of the Airbuses and uh, they're not the prettiest aeroplanes in the world but they do serve a purpose of getting a lot of passengers from A to B very very efficiently. When you've got an airliner of the Comet uh, stature then you're looking at something which was designed without computers, without computer aided design or anything like that. It's basically uh, people with an idea of what an airliner should look like and transforming that idea into a flying aircraft presented beautifully here uh, in the bottom of the So what I'm going to do, I'll put an and again, these, these aircraft are not things that they go out of just land. You've got to prepare yourself for it, both mentally, prepare where you are, and weather conditions, and now. Okay, and just for the crowd, uh, Steve's feeling very confident with this model today. He's got the wheels down, but this is just going to be a touch and go. So he's just going to come through, kiss the wheels on the tarmac, roll up the tarmac with the power off, and then not his full landing. There's your touch. See the turbine scrolling up. Game. See the time it takes to settle down, uh, the time it takes for the turbines to spool up, and the amount of runway required to get it back in the air again. Not something that could be rushed in any way. So on finals now. <laughs> oh, 
holding it off, nose in the air. Main wheel's down now, just holding the nose wheel up and dropping it down very, very, very gently. And there was no passenger on earth could have complained about landing that. Thank you. 